yes, it's true. I think these are better than popcorn. I mean, everybody loves a good bowl of popcorn you're watching a movie or something, but if you want something special, these crunchy chickpeas are the way to go. Now, chickpeas are garbanzo beans. That's another name for them, and you can get them in cans. That's what I'm using today, two 15-ounce cans of chickpeas that have been rinsed, drained, and just dried a little bit with some paper towels. And while we're getting these ready, you should be preheating your oven to 450 degrees. First thing I wanna do is drizzle some olive oil on these, maybe a tablespoon or two. So mix these together here. Get that oil on all of them. Now we're gonna season this twice. Right now we're gonna add our seasoning and at the end we're also gonna sprinkle some seasoning on. Now really, seasoning is totally up to you. You could hit these with some salt, you'd be fine. Some chili powder, you'd be fine. I'm using tahine, which is sort of a chili lime seasoning. Very popular, you'll find it in Spanish markets. Super, super flavor. I'm just gonna sprinkle some on here. Mix everybody around, get some more. We wanna get a good coating on these. Not excessive, but we want everybody to have some. All right, let's get these on a baking sheet so we can get them in the oven. I have a piece of parchment paper on my baking sheet here. If you don't have parchment paper, you could do it straight on the baking sheet. And we just wanna spread everybody around so no one's piled on top of anyone else here. These are gonna go in our preheated 450 degree oven for 30 minutes. I'll see you back here in 30 minutes. All right, here they are. Nice and toasty, right at 30 minutes. Every oven's a little different. Yours may take a little longer, may take a little less. I usually start checking them around 20, 25 minutes just to see if they're at that stage where they're getting toasty. And you can tell just like right now if you take a quick taste. Mm, awesome. You want them crunchy on the outside, soft in the middle. You don't want like a hard rock all the way through. I'm gonna transfer these to a bowl right now and get some more seasoning on them before we plate them up. Hit these with a little bit more of the tahine. Pass those around. All right, I'm gonna dish these up. Already had that pre-taste without the extra tahine. Let's see how we do now. Mm. Again, popcorn, nothing against you, but if I've got the time and the chickpeas, I'm making this. 